Welcome to Axie Byte, where we explain Axie Infinity in bite size. Today, we'll be looking at energy calculation. So what is energy calculation? Why do we need to calculate it when we already know each player will always get 2 energy after each round? Remember in the episode where we discussed round 1 preparation? Some of the cards that we need to look out for are cards that cost 0 energy and cards that can gain or steal energy. If you do not keep track of what cards your opponent use and how many, you'll lose track of how much energy they have and this could mess up your ability to predict their next moves. Here's the general formula that you can use to calculate your opponent's energy. Energy for the next round equals to current energy minus energy spent minus energy stolen or destroyed by you, if any, plus energy gained or stolen by them, plus 2. Here are some things you need to take into account. Pay attention to the cost of the cards that they use. Some could cost 2 energies, some could cost 0. Always remember to add 2 at the end because each round gives the players 2 extra energy. If you already have 0 energy, your opponent won't gain any energy if they try to steal one from you. Here's a pop quiz before we end the episode. How many energies will the opponent have if they use these two cards in round 1? Remember, round 1 starts with 3 energies. That's right, they'll end up with 6 energies with just these two cards. How do we get 6? Here's the calculation. 3 minus 1 from Vegetal Bite plus 2 from stolen energy and energy gain from disguise, plus 2 from start of round 2, you get 6. I hope this also helps you to realize the importance of a good round 1 preparation and knowing what cards your opponent have. And that wraps up our episode for today. Be sure to like and subscribe for more of our content and leave a comment down below if you want us to cover anything. And that's today's XC Byte. See you on the next one.